Hey YouTubers, Shamus here. Today I'm going to bring to y'all the 2023 edition of my TM Books and Videos DVD collection. Sorry for this increase in offers, have not. Like, I got, the, I believe I got the all the Iowa Toy Trains, um, I believe I got the, um, parts on um, DVD finally. I'm just missing, like, maybe the reprint ones that are, like, they are like a, um, um, 2005 or 2004, 9 reprint, 5, but I did used to have one copy of this, but I got rid of it and replaced it with the original. I'm missing the two remasters on DD, which is Ticket, All Board and Ticket and Ride. I'm also missing Field though. Like, I'm missing, I got... I'll tell you, I'm missing part two on with this. Yes. I'm also missing the um the last HO D. So we're further away. Let's get started. First we have Toy 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 America Video Series. Part one to six um two thousand four D. I believe I bought this at a first store near my house, not for Goodwill, which I have no idea how this ended up here. But I guess it was purchased for one one point and was only there. I have both I have all these parts in the um, VHS. There's this one which part one three. This two six for four. Next up we have the Toy Hair View Original Print T T D DDs that have from the um, original show. I believe I have one of these, um, I believe I have one of the parts on VHS, which is 8. I believe I have Toy Story Review 8 on VHS. Here's this one, this 2, this 3, this 4. I'm gonna got, I believe I got this from TM website, I believe in... I believe in April 2020, so I can be able to purchase something that year since... There was pretty much no New York at that year because of COVID. Here's, um, part 5 to 12. This nine, this two combine seven, nine, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Well, I believe, um, uh, I believe one of the discs, um, does have the, um, actual video, which, not sure which one is. I don't know if it's this one or something, um, I think. I think it has a different video, which is disappointing. I hope I find the VHS car part that has the correct version. I believe it's hard to find. Next up is um, the Iowa Toy Trains um, 1, 2, 3, 2002 DD. And speaking of which, I believe there is a 99 DD, 1999 DD at this, which is very hard to find. I forget if my channel quarters have that. I believe it's an out print DVD. Well, this one's common. Not sure what contact it has. I don't know if it has the same contact as or original contact. I'm not sure. This is an insert. Hope I get this on DD. DD and VHS. I have this on VHS. I have these on DD. Here's. I have all these parts on. DVD. I still have to get the VHS card parts. I'm missing part two of Toy Train Christmas um, on VHS as well as the Our Christmas Original 96 VHS. I still have to get part three. This interest could be common on these DVDs, so this is the only time I'm going to show it. We got the 2009 re reprint version. This has um, updated stuff, I believe, on it. The only downside is that it shows the part 11, 12, 2009 D the cases twice, which is a mistake error. I hope we get some of the upper reprints, but I'm not sure about, about it. But particularly um, because they might have the same stuff as this, except with different end, end credits or something. Next that we have the 2000. Four of six, two thousand five DD, but this is inside. It's not the two thousand five DD, which um, I believe I, I believe I got these DDs from a lot from eBay, 
It also came with this. But although that one was a 2005 reprint. I'll show you what I mean in just a second. Just the back. Well, it's inside. Does not have the 2005 DVD. Instead, it has the 2002 DVD. Which I have no idea how this happened. I'm not sure there's a full copy case of the 2002 DVD. I'm hoping, hoping someday I could get this correct casing. Well, well, still happy have it. I know when Trayvon has this part, these parts, um, 2002 these car parts of these. Next up, I'll torture seven to nine. This is the 2002 original DD. I believe this DD is cool. It's pretty very rare because the menu is kind of different than the reprint one from 2005, I believe. This one. It has a different menu and out creds. Um, I'll have to show you some proof someday. Here's the disc. I'll have to show it someday if I, when I feel like it. Once I get a couch car again, and I'll do openings and closings and menu on tours again. Here's um, part 10 to 12. I originally had this DD in 2010, but I lost it in 2012, but was able to get back in my collection, I believe, in 2020. I believe um, this was actually my first Iowa Toy Train CD I acquired when I started collecting this show. I believe this, I started collecting these series around 20 times when I was in 9 years old and I believe in 3rd grade or something when I was in elementary school. I really enjoyed their videos. Next up we have the final show, 2004 DD. Hmm. Hmm. Here's the disc. And that reminds me, um, just so you know, if you're wondering, where's my, um, I Would Be Trains Part 1 to 3 DVD? Well, I don't know about if you knew this or not. I kind of don't feel like showing it. And plus, I'm thinking of upgrading it to the original 2005 DVD because that one has kind of an update menu. It has no end credits. That's my only complaint of the DVD. I'm planning to donate and maybe get the original. Next up, we have Oh No. I believe this is a. This is for 2004. It contains part one that was on VHS as well as Bo's part, part two, which was not on VHS. Here's the disc. This is a reprint because of this disc style. It's from 2016. Kind of interesting. The only downside is the case is what this ripped on there. But, oh well, I can deal with it. Next up, we have our Toy Train's The Music Video, 2005 DD. I bought this actually at the TM Our Toy Train store in Michigan City, Indiana. This is, I believe, from 2005. It contains mostly the parts the music they have. I believe I have part one on via Deep Chess. I believe it's pretty much the only one they mean. Hmm, just like, let me check. Um, yeah, it mostly consists of some of the songs were actually on the VHS and offers or not. Like, I don't think that you, uh, was a train was on this, but I'm not sure. I'll have to take a look. Here's the disc. Here's the insert. Book with. Hmm. Hope I get these, these on DVD. Hmm. And... Don't think I have these on DD. Hope and get them someday. Not sure if I want to get the CD or something. I'm, I'm missing that on DD. I suppose I could watch this with my cousin Tristan because he likes airplanes while I'm into trains. Oh, oh, sorry. I'm looking to get a new, a better one that's a virtual roof for 2005. I hope I get this on DD VHS. Hope I get part one of this video on VHS. Part 2 on DD and VHS. I believe I have this on VHS and DD, which the VHS car part is supposed to be extreme rare because it's a 2006 VHS. VHS tapes that are released in 2006 are technically extreme rare. Let me double check. Is this, is this correct? Is this how it's supposed to go? Yeah, I'm right. 
It came, the other one came with the same one, so we're not going to show it. I believe I have some stuff that, I believe this has different songs than part one. Well, hold on. Now, I gotta get this back in the box up. I believe this is my only TM DVD I have that comes in this particular DVD box, I believe. Hope we get some more today. Next up, we have um, our toy trains, the World the Rails, 2013 DVD. They did a reissue in 2017, which I'm hoping you get that someday. That one does have Vinny the puppet on this particular release. Well, this one does. I think I prefer this or that. Although some people complain Vinny the puppet being too creepy. If any of you guys hate Vinny the puppet, I respect your opinion. Next up is Real Brazen. I believe I got this these the same day where I was at that store. Hmm. I believe this was the first time I showed Jeff, uh, first time since the final show, I believe. Here's the disc. I believe this is the, I'm missing these um, best parts on DVD 2012. I'm hoping to get them someday. Next up is Our Cat Machines Part 1 to 2 DVD. I bought this, I believe, at a thrift store in 2021. This D is for 2003. Still have to get the VHS tapes car part this video. Actually replace the case on this one because the original case that originally came in came broken. I might have to get this on VHS and DD. Despite it's babyish, I still have to get or complete the collection. This I'm missing on VHS and DD. Hmm. I'm hoping I get that someday. Next up, it's a new one I acquired. I got this in eBay. I want this as a big auction, I believe, in 2023. Still from 2003, I believe. Didn't hear anything like my other one, so that's okay. This one has Jeff World. I believe this one has Jeff Nearing World. This one, I believe, doesn't. Which is interesting, I guess. Next up is Our Big Machines um, DVD with part one and part two. This DVD is from 2005. I believe I got this DVD on February 8, 2022. I believe that was the day after I had the um, was it emergency room trip where I had a spoiler in my toe, I believe. That was one of the reasons why I wasn't active um, between February and March. Here's the disc. I think I also got the World Barfers VHS at the Char Brown Valentine. I believe I got and what else did I get? What if I got an RT? Did I not? Oh, and Kipper's Playtime I also got. Hmm. I believe I have this on DVD. I'm hoping to get this on DVD. I want to let's flip it over. Um, this is so fun. I believe this is the only part that you made on DD. Not sure why do you make any more sequels. I want kind of like the same situation as All About Train situation. I wonder why it was supposed to be a video series, but I'm not sure. Maybe it didn't go well as successfully. You're at All Out Cowboy for Kids Part 1 DD. I bought this at Selfish Army in June, July 23. Mom! Hmm, that's weird. Um, I can still do a clutch view. There's disc. I'm not sure if it's a power out or something. I don't know. I don't know if she turned off the lights or something, but this clutch view still has to go. Next up, we have American Fire Gilbert. Um, this consists of part one and part two that were on VHS. I believe I have part two on VHS. I bought this during the Circus Train Fair, I believe, um, last year. Here's the disc itself. Is this the same one? Let me double check. Yeah, it's probably the same one, so 
I'm not going to show it too common. Oh, I'll fix it and make it look correct. What's it going? Yeah, that's better. Well, I still have to be part of this. Next up, we have the Toy Go I know server layouts. I have this. I bought this DD door small train convention in my club there. Hmm. This consists of these fields that were on VHS. So I still have to get them someday. Here's the disc. This DD is from 2005. Same answer, so I'm not going to show. Next up is this. I believe I bought this DD during the Springfield, Massachusetts train show they had. Um, January 2020, they must have been lucky to have that show because, um, three months later, um, two months later, COVID struck. Here's the disc itself. Hmm. I believe this is the same answer show that I showed, so I'm not going to bother to show it. I'm I don't know if you knew this or not. I think I maybe posted the close to the VHS car park. Because it has a very rare, I believe, I will try to show in preview that contains the final show of this. It could be only found in the future. It can't be found in the studio, unfortunately. Next up is um, All About John Near for Kids Part 1 DD. I'm not sure where I got this DD. I believe in 20 or 2019. I'm not sure. I also have this part on VHS. Which I bought from Southeast Army, I believe, in 2021. I think I'm not sure. Next up. But I don't have this part on DD. I still have to get the Fiat Chess car part this video. Here's the disc. I bought this, I believe, from eBay. And I believe the previous person purchased it from their savers they had in their area or something. Here's part three. I got this um, at a thrift store. I want part four. I believe it's the same. Here's the disc. Um, not for the show. Next up is part four on DVD. I'm looking to fixing this with my GEC Pro because because once this DVD reached to the end credits or something, it starts skipping. So. Thankfully, hop out the credits, not during the program, so that was a big goodness. I had to fix up my GEC Pro probably some days so I could get this working again, I guess. Hmm. Next up is this uh, bitch. This this is a reprint for 2011 from 2001. Although, the only downside is that the VHS tapes of these series from that eBay sale. Some of them came old, according to Will and I, as well as, um, who's it? Hot, uh, who's that? I believe there's another person, um, I forgot what his name was. He's also a team collector like Will and I. I believe, I forgot what his name, I'll have a link in the description. I bought this at the York Train Convention. Next up. We're not done because I also have part two on DD. I think I got the VHS first. I believe I bought a GR Junction in 2019, I believe. It has some half shrink wrap around it. Mine is has a stick rifle and label one. I think with Train Fat's copy of this tape actually has an ink label, which is very interesting. Um, oh well. That's very interesting. Next up we have part three. I did get, I also got the VHS tapes uh, that I have clean. I had to buy two of them to get them. One was, this one was on, first one was unsuccessful. One second was successful. Same with that. Although the only downside is that power on VHS, it's a little damaged at the beginning. And this one, I clean. It was, although the only downside is that it's um, kind of jumpy, which I'm not sure how it is. I mean, 
it's not damaged because I buy brand new or something, or if it became moldy or something, I have no idea. I'll just show you something. Next up is um, America. America Wine House Gray Model Trends Part 1, 2, 2014. I believe I have. Um, yes, I believe I have Part 1 on VHS. Still have to get Part 2 on VHS. I believe the VHS days were released in like 96 or something. Here's the disc. I could probably show it. I believe I bought this at uh, Train Hub Shop in Virginia. That was near a virtual rail camera. I believe I got this. Next up is Celebrity Wine Century of Wine Out Trains 2002 DD. This was on VHS in 2000, which is a two tape set. I bought this DD, I believe, during New York Train Convention in 2016. This is a reprint because it says 2011 on the back. Copyright. I wonder if the original 2002 DD has a different menu instead of this? I'll have to check it out see if someday. But I'll still keep the Ava if I get him. Oops, sorry. I think I might need to make a new stack. Sorry about that. Um, they kind of worse. I think I should not do what that ever. I think I'll have to mix my own, but we need to put their out Sorry about that. What DD was I about to show next again? Mm -hmm. Let's see. I believe uh, this DD. I believe I got this from the company that had been where I was at this particular place, along with part three of Storm Train, so every train. I also, I think I got one of the Go the Go DDs um, from that uh, hobby shop, I believe. I went there, I believe, in 2020. I believe it was in July or something. What the? I believe it was, um, Diego, um, all right, Dave Giggles Rainforest Festival 2019. That's what it was called. Now I remember. This is for 2012. This was a series that Tim was supposed to make a sequel, but they weren't for sure. They wanted to make a sequel because they wanted to make the remaster. I believe 200 reviews, um, but that's things. Um, but I wish this got more reviews. Same with some offers that I'm. I don't know about this. I heard the big trends of Toy Train CRM series that did so well in the 90s. I thought it's not via chess at all. I wonder if TM should maybe release their extreme rare tapes or ones that never got a DD release. I wonder if they should release them on a strange or a DD or something. That's why I'm being concerned. There's the remaster D. I got this from TM website. There's part one. Actually, the disc from part two to four are actually reprints, I believe, because they have a uh, born disc instead of uh, artwork. I so like that. Kind of interesting, huh? That's interesting. How knew that? There are two point legends in action part one to six. DD, I believe they were, I think. I don't know if you knew this or not. I believe that TM was supposed to do a part six of this voice. It's kind of delay or something. I'm not sure. Um, I'm not sure what's causing it to get delay. I don't know if it's because of financial situation or something. Here's, here's. This is what the trains were made before World War II. This DD box says, I believe, from 2013, although the back says it's kind of from 2014, which is kind of strange. Not sure. Here are the Magical Wino Trains DD. This is a reprint because in this case, I still have to get part free, I believe, on VHS. That's the only part I'm missing on VHS. Hope I get that soon. I got this in the April um, York train show they had this year, I believe. Next is um, the Great Toy Train Stories, um, 2006 DD. The VHS cover is a very rare one. 
This is a reprint from 2011, as you can see on the back. I wonder if the 2006 original GD, I wonder if that has even updated original instead of this. Well, I believe that one would have been the only TM um, video they ever done on VHS on Etro Scare, I believe, or a different gauge that wasn't like, um, O gauge, standard gauge, or current gauge, for example. Or S gauge. Next up, we have How Build Your Own HO Layout. This DD is from 2012. I still have one more kit, which is, um, I believe in 2018 they made this. I made videos on HO Layouts and how they tell their stories. I believe that's the only, um, HO TM DD. I miss it. Let's all get that out and finish the collection. Here we have Railroads on Parades 2012 DD. I got this DD for Christmas in 2019. And I don't know if you knew this. I actually went to this. Except that they did this video twice. I believe in 2011 and 2012. Although the place that they did this video, unfortunately, it's no longer around. It shut down, I believe, in 2015. Which, um, the people that built, the the people on this, um, they still build train routes for companies. They just don't own the exit anymore. I'm not sure why it shut down. Um, I mean, that's things how it shut down. Yeah. Too bad the hobby of this particular thing is on decline because of rise of singers and our stuff. Next up, we have MTH Great Train Lands 2005 DD. Um, I'm not sure where I got this. Um, I believe I got this from a train hop show or something. I do have part two on VHS. So we'll have to get part one on VHS. Here's the disc. Um, Next up is the Golden Train Layouts 2012 DD. I believe I bought this at the Morrisville Green Mars Train Toy Show in 2016, the July one. Here's this. Next up is a line now Christmas. At the Fiat Trust card part of this. Um, this is the remastered one that we finally get a DD released in like um, 29, 2009. They also made a sequel of this one, which would be released in like um, 2010 or something. So I have to get that on TV. There's the disc itself. I believe this is a different insert than one I'm sure. Let me double check. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I believe. I'm missing, I'm kind of missing these. Although I have this, mine copy, I have this DD is actually for a rental from some library that is somewhere near Rochester. I bought it at first store, and I believe it was getting ready for or something. Here I have Lionel Legends, the Hudson. I have part two on VHS. I hope I get part one on VHS. I wonder if it's extreme or something. Here's this. Well, I'm not going to show that. Too common. Next up is Fun the Farm. Um, these DJs were released, these parts were released from 2001 to 2012. Well, this is, is a, the, uh, a preschool show, but I just had to get over complete the question. This DD com combo set, this release will be released in 2016 or 15, I believe. I bought this, I believe, at an antique store near my grandma's, grandpa's area. Oh, that reminds me. I don't know if you all heard, but my grandpa's right now in the hospital, if you haven't heard, for some foot issue. This is the one I have. See, I, you could tell it's a four round from library from Prosper, New York. Um, not sure. I believe I bought this at a first store where... I believe it was the same one where I bought the Ways of Town um, Superheroes 2005 DD in 2022 in December while I was at the RIT Treasure or something. Here's the disc. This receipt would be to tell if it's scratched or crack or skipping or freezing audio unseen or crack or whatever so during. Hmm. Interesting. Well, I don't, I don't think they need to have this sent anymore because particularly the library pretty much got rid of this DD. There's Toy Train Spectacular 2001 DD. 
don't know if you knew this or not. I did hear there's a four pack DD set of this Christmas movies that contains like, um, what's it got? I believe it's got Toy Train Spectacular, Toy Train um, Christmas, as well as the new train, Toy Train Christmas stories. I thought of maybe upgrading it to it someday. Right now it's not on camera, so maybe somewhere pops up somewhere and then I'll get it and donate this series. I'll keep it until I get that. I believe it's hard to find. Here's this. This is a short, I believe, that consists of parts that were on DD. I believe I bought this DD at a garage sale. I believe in May 1st, 2020. I believe I was on my way to the Fulton, New York train show they had. I believe that was the only train show they had in spring 2020 because of um, COVID as well as Wait until the fall when the ones in the fall reopened, I believe. Here I have. I got this DD at the train hop shop in Rochester, I believe. I believe it was one that had fire in 2014 but was able to reopen. That was a surprise. This is a 2012 DD reprint on back. I also, I believe I got, um, I believe I got mine. I believe I also got this Mind Machine CD from that train, same hobby shop. Here's the disc. And to make this clear, I think I seen where they use buyers from Real Shack, which unfortunately Real Shack is pretty much not around. Um, I mean, they closed out a lot of stores. Um, I'm not sure what place the car has a replacement for this nowadays. I'm not sure what place carries wires the same as Radio Shack, but hoping um, that they could find a solution. Here we have Real Scenes 1.1. This is where TM decided to let the trains talk and stop them talking, just for a change. I got this DD for my 21 birthday of last year. Here's disc. I'm missing some of the layered TM DDs. Toy Trains and Christmas War around 2019 DD. I think this, I got this DD the day before Thanksgiving, I believe, in 2019. Here's the disc. That would have been my last Thanksgiving break I had in up, um, the early years of school before I graduated in 2020. Here we have Twice for Century Train House 2016 DD. When I got this DD, it also came with a keychain for some train that came with this couple set which is pretty nice i have it i believe i have it on one of my parents car i'm not sure if i still have it or not but hopefully it doesn't get far now. or not that i have part two i i believe that got this dd during 2019 april show along with part four i got this in i believe i got this one in 2018 show here's the disc Sorry, spoiler word that. Here's the disc. Um, this one was recent 22. I believe the copyright on the part two says the wrong copyright date from that year. That's part four. I believe this is the last part they me on DD. It's from 2019. Here's the disc. And we have World Cross Highway Rail Part 4 2012 DD. I'm missing Part 1, Part 2, and Part 3 on DD. Hope I get them someday. I believe I also bought this during the Circus Train Convention last year. Here's this. I believe I got the 2002 DD of this from the 2012 one show when they reopened. Here I have this. Um, I still have to get Part 1 on DD. And believe it or not, on the back it says they were going to. Next is um, part three, getting ready, starting with MTH's DCS consistent. Copyright says it's from 2018, now it's from 2017. Not sure, um, it, I'm not sure what happened to this video. I don't know if it was a, like, a video that was supposed to be released but got canceled or something. I'm not sure why they didn't do that. I don't know if it's because of the Mike Wolf retirement. Something I'm not sure. But at least Wino Apple must have took over his rights for his trip. Except for Wino Nation won. There's this. Is this the same? I'm not going to have my camera seat. Yeah, it's definitely the same, so I'm not going to show it. 
Yeah, it's the same one, so I'm not definitely sure. Mm. Okay. Here at part two. This one is um from 2018. Well, this one is from I don't know if it's from 2018 or 29, 2009, 2008, or I'm not sure. Here's the disc. I believe I got this DD from a Norwich train museum or something. Oh no, I got that one from that. Never mind. My bad. You have part three. This is from 2009. Here's the disc. Same answer, so not going to bother show it. Here are part four. This is from 2009 or 10, I think. I believe, I believe the trailer for, I believe, I believe the trailer, um, for this particular video, like, the, tr not the movie, um, not the actual movie, but the DD trailer for this, I believe it's not on YouTube. Oh, Tim, that will post it. And one time I did post that um, trailer, I believe, in 2013 on my shopping account. It was like a test video. I kind of deleted that. But I don't know about this. I could maybe repost it on this channel or something, I think. As well as I don't get copyrighted. You're a part free. But this is released in 2010. That was year one when I started doing visual on trains. Here's the disc. And interesting fact, I went to one of the places that was featured. I believe it's the Choo Choo Diner that's in um, somewhere in Illinois where cheeseburgers and fries are delivered while I'm trying. I visited that area here at part six. I bought this at the Greenburn train show in Rochester, I believe. The 2016 show on the return, but although it was at the Dome Center, I believe it was to have some Grave Bill Haven Graveyard Ice Cream Rink, I think it was at. Okay. Next up, we have part seven. I bought this at the Western New York's Train Toy Show, the November 2015 show. I believe I got this DD. I believe that was when they had a show returned back into doing the November show after the previous one from the previous year in 2014 got canceled. I haven't been to that show in a while, but hopefully, I'll go back there in February or something. I'm also hoping they have one this November because um, um, I'm hoping there's no snowstorm, wake effect, snow or blizzard. I hope it doesn't happen the same day as they do that show. Okay. Here at part eight, the final part on the Yeah, it's correct. Never mind. This one's from 2012, the final part of this show. This will be the last part. It will be sort of like Toy Train review, but. With final trains or something. Next up, we have trains are cool. I have the shirt car part this video. Here, how trains are cool 2021. DD. I believe it was supposed to be called this, but it's different. Both, um, I believe both me and William Train Fair, I believe we both are guard DDs the same day as we um, got these. Quincy and we. Yeah. I believe it was some what the days of March of 2021, I think. And I, I forgot the date, but because where was channel had to be temporarily removed or something. Here at part two. I had to take the well because it was um broke it was breaking so I didn't want to I believe these are the only parts they made on DD, I believe. Kind of like the same number of parts of like the big trains and toy trains that was on VHS and 94. You have TM's okay 12 maintenance you could do with part one. They made this DD because of like train home shops that go around business as well as telling people how to fix these trains. I believe this is from the same guy that told me did the legacy system. Although copyright says toy toy although it's from 2021. Also, in this part, um, I told this to William Train Fan on Community Post. I said in this part, they revealed that Tom Acosa is not actually retiring. He's not retiring from making videos. But he says that 
Most of his videos are basically on TV, and they're not as popular as they used to be because of the rise of streaming service and other stuff. Also, Walmart's looking to save the DD, a brewery business, so it doesn't have any large trust teams. Here's the disc. I believe I ordered two copies of Parfrey on Axon, but I would donate that DD, I believe, in uh, Ju June or July uh, this year to his Goodwill. Here are part two. I got this in 2020. They signed it, which is cool. Here at part three. I believe this is the newest TM DDD released. I believe this is from 2022. I heard they're making a new album of 2020's DD um, when um, to celebrate four years. Right now, it's um, it's unknown when it's going to be released. They show a sneak peek so far. And I heard James copy me a return on that video, surprisingly. I'm not sure what these are going to be recent. Next up, it's the Blu-ray. This is pretty much the only TM Blu-ray they made. I believe it was made in 2019. I post the opening of this thing. I believe. Here's the disc. Hmm. Yeah. I wonder if TM's going to like, make more Blu-rays or not. I'm just wondering. Not sure. Who knows? Okay, that's about it. Hope you're enjoying. Peace out.